It's blast off for a real life rocket man. Holy <laughs> he did it! The self-taught engineer propelled himself 1,875 feet into the sky in his homemade steam-powered rocket. Onlookers are amazed. Whoa! But his descent nearly turned into a disaster. Oh my God, watch out, guys, watch out. The rocket is zooming back to Earth at 350 miles an hour. He deploys a parachute to slow down the descent, then another chute. But boom, it's a crash landing. Response teams in the Mojave Desert rush over to help. Bystanders cheer him on, but the 61-year-old rocket man, known as Mad Mike Hughes, feared he'd broken his back. Easy, easy, easy. Easy, guys, easy. your butt. I don't know if I broke my back. Please, I don't know if I broke my back. Photos show Mad Mike building his rocket over the last 10 years, all to prove what most people consider a ridiculous notion. The world, I believe, is honestly flat. We caught up with the limo driver today, ironically outside court, where he was fighting a speeding ticket. I took a pretty hard hit, and I'm uh, feeling it right now. I, I believe I have a compressed uh, fracture of one of my lower vertebrae. He says the rocket ride was terrifying. It's scary because once you pull the lever and you release the plunger, there's no way to stop it. Even so, this rocket man says he's glad he did it. And by the way, the earth is definitely not flat. Mr. Hughes hopes to raise $2 million so he can go into space and prove his opinion that the Earth is shaped like a Frisbee.